Skippers, this is Dawn from DawnStippingThoughts.net and today we're going to make this little cute reindeer candy cane holder. Isn't it cute? Holds two candy canes. And you can really actually get all different colors of the candy canes and just coordinate them like I did for the snowman one here. I just used the basic red and white candy canes for him. Isn't he cute? Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're using a piece of chocolate chip cardstock and this is cut at five and a half by six. And we're going to grab our Stampin' Trimmer. And this is going to be the five and a half inch side across the top. And we're going to score this at one and a quarter, two and a half, three and three quarters, and five. Okay, and we're going to turn it along the six inch side across the top. And we're going to score it at one and a quarter on both sides here. One there, and then we're going to turn it and then score this at one and a quarter. Okay, Okay. so now we're just going to go ahead and fold all our score lines. Okay, so this is the envelope punch board, and what we're going to do is we're going to only do one side of the box. So first we're just going to fold on this score line here, and you're just going to slide this in, and you're going to line it up to one and a quarter. So one and a quarter, and then you're going to go ahead and punch. Okay. Alright, then you're going to open that up, then you're going to go ahead and fold the next score line. Lining that up with one and a quarter again, and you're going to go ahead and punch. Okay, and then you're just going to continue going down, folding it, and then folding it, and then also doing this edge right here where it's going to be a single punch. Don't forget that edge, because when it lines up, it's going to look like that. All right, so just don't forget that last edge. All right, okay, so I went ahead already and did that. Now I'm going to add some sticky strip along this edge right here. But first we're going to go ahead and remove this piece, this corner piece right here. Don't need that. Okay, so now we're just going to go ahead and add sticky strip along this edge right here. Okay. All right, so now we're going to make the bottom of the box, and we're just going to cut our slits up to that one and a quarter inch score line. Okay, then we're going to add some more sticky strip. We're going to add a piece, oh, there's my ribbon. We're going to add a piece of sticky strip here and here. Okay, so now before we put our box together, which is going to go together like this, so what you're going to need is a piece of basic black and um, also the chocolate chip. And I'm going to use the half inch circle punch. It's going to punch out one of the chocolate chip and then two of the basic black. And these are just basically for his eyes. So I'm going to cut the chocolate chip in half. And then I would put dimensionals along the edge of those. Okay, so dimensional on the chocolate chip piece, and then you're just going to put this on top of the basic black, like that. And you would do both pieces just like that, and I went ahead already and did that, just to save some time. Okay, so now we're just going to go ahead and take our black stamp okay, and right so marker. Okay, figure out again which side you want the front to be. I'm going to do my front right here, so the second panel. So I'm going to go ahead and attach the eyes first. There. And about there. Okay, and then I'm just going to draw on the little eyebrows here. And then also I'm going to make a little smile down here. And then once that's done, then I'm going to take the white gel pen. I'm going to dot the centers of the eyes. 
Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and put the box together. So fold this over to the edge, just like that. And then this edge down at the bottom. Okay, you can take your bone folder and make sure you get a good adhered side there. All right, so then we're going to close up the bottom of the box. All right, so now we're just going to go ahead and close the flap on the front. It's just going to be pinched together just like that. Okay, so it should be like on the side here. We're just going to kind of pinch it closed. Just like that. And this would be where you would put your candy canes inside before we tie it up. Okay. And then I have some early espresso. I believe this is the seam binding ribbon. And I'm just going to tie a bow along the front. Now one more thing, we're going to add a little red nose for Rudolph. It's going to take some liquid glue. I'm just going to put a big old dab of glue there because I have a whole bunch of these pom-poms. And I'm just going to use a sparkly red one here. Turn that off. Yeah, and this is going to go right in the center for his nose. Just hold it there for a little bit. He's so cute. Okay, so that's how you make that cute box. And here's the other one. And then here's the snowman one. And they both stand up too, which is really cute. I can't really stand that one up because the nose is still wet. But yeah, they're so super cute. Okay, so thanks for stopping by and we'll see you later. Bye.